day to you, my friends. I have put together a short, funny clip of crazy, unhedged, raging, angry liberals going stark raving mad because Kamala lost. Enjoy this, my friends. You voted against me. You have voted against my right to live. You voted against all the women and their rights. I hate to be the person that gets on here and cries, but this could sp this could break me and my parents apart because they just don't understand what they voted for and like what it means and the bigotry and hatred that they stand behind and how I like am trying to be a good person. So it's almost two a.m. Pacific time, which means it's. Well, after both of those, and I am still just genuinely confused as to what happened. So, if anyone wants to offer some insight, we may not have rights tomorrow. Yeah, I'm scared to go to sleep. I might wake up a motherfucking sleigh. <laughs> I personally think that if all of these men are voting to take our rights away, they don't deserve to touch a woman for the next four years. So, hope you thought that through, you guys. Um, is anyone else helping a meltdown? I don't know how to do this. I don't know how to wait. I'm so stressed. How you can't look out into the world, into the people of this country, and see what's happening. And how hard we're all fighting for rights not to be taken away from people. thing to me is that if this guy does end up winning again all of the people who voted for him will be like happy and they'll just be celebrating and everyone else everyone who feels threatened by him is fucking scared so it's almost 2 a.m pacific time which means it's well after both of those and i am still just genuinely confused as to what happened so if anyone Wants to offer some insight. Stop. Stop. Damn. Well. See, that's why I'm recording. Because the cops ain't gonna believe this shit. If you voted for Donald Trump, I will never not know that about you. And that's something we'll both have to live with. We don't care. Let me tell you. Right, let me tell you. <laughs> we this is all break, right? Like, like we're just gonna wake up tomorrow morning and everything's gonna go back to the way. It, like, it'll all it'll be a psych. It'll be like a really bad dream, and none of this will have ever happen, right? Like, it'll be like the first time, and then we're all gonna pull through fine in four years, correct? Please, someone tell me. I can tell you one thing right now, marriage is the farthest thing from on the table currently. So they really, they screwed the pooch on that one if they thought that any of this was going to actually help with the whole family and kids department and, and lowering birth rates because that, no, nah, nah, -uh, not even. Any semblance of thoughts I had or hope for that is completely going to be a no thanks for me, love. Do you think I would ever even dare bring a child into this country now? It was rough before. Now? No. That's cute. And the men, don't even give me, no, don't even get me started about dating. To think, I was still entertaining a few moderates here and there sometimes. No, honey, no. Not even close. That's never goodbye. Mm -hmm.